According to the National Cancer Institute, between 2016 and 2020, there were about 27 cases of melanoma of the skin per 100,000 people in Maine. And checking for skin cancer can certainly be a tough process. Now doctors at a hospital in New York City are working with 3D imaging and artificial intelligence to better detect even the slightest changes in moles and other potential markers for melanoma. Paisy Chang reports. Hey, good morning, Nancy. Hello. How are you? Nancy Stokes is back for a checkup. Last month, she had a melanoma removed from her left temple, the second one discovered this year. Yeah, it looks like a keratosis. Looks all right to me. Growing up in Breezy Point, Nancy spent a lot of time at the beach. Now at 62, she's dealing with the consequences of too much sun. So we didn't put anything on. I mean, if, you know, if you put anything on, it was something to attract the sun, not, not uh, keep it away. So, uh, you know, it was, it was, it's much different. Yeah, if you just lean forward. Dr. Ashfaq Margoop of Memorial Sloan Kettering discovered both of Nancy's melanomas. And the goal with all of this technology is to try and find melanomas while they're, skin, while they're very, very thin before they have had the opportunity to spread. Using technology like 3D body imaging, Dr. Margoob can very quickly identify and catalog the more than 500 moles on Nancy's body. And if I click on that, it will actually take us to that spot on uh, her avatar. And now you can kind of zoom in on that lesion. 92 cameras will take photos of the patient all at once. And then a computer will generate a 3D image of that patient. It only takes 12 minutes. Memorial Sloan Kettering was among the first to use the 3D imaging. Dr. Margoob says artificial intelligence compares scans of patients over time and can detect the slightest changes. It helped identify a melanoma on Nancy's back. I would never have thought that that pink one was, um, was anything that was dangerous. So that was pretty, that was actually a little scary. More than 4,000 New York residents are diagnosed with melanoma a year, with nearly 500 New Yorkers dying from it. And it ranks among the top four cancers for those 20 to 34 years old. And as allowing us to see just below the, the surface of the skin. With high-tech scopes, Dr. Margu can also look beneath the surface of the skin and detect cancer without having to do a biopsy. The goal is to catch melanomas before they can spread. If you can catch this melanoma before it has the ability to go get into the vasculature or the lymphatics, you basically can cure it by simple surgical excision.